capture the moment. Oh gosh, my voice. Oh. Yes. Oh, you can't see my jazz hands. There are my jazz hands. Ooh, jazz hands. This is what songwriters look like in their natural habitat. But again, my fur is so cozy. Anywho, hi there. I'm Beth, your Monday person. Um, so today we're talking about idols. I don't really have any idols. So really with me, it just like, it depends on what an idol means to me. So to me, I think an idol is someone who you look up to and you want to be like them, like in the future. So my, I think my top two idols really are Selena Gomez, because she's a pretty nice and pretty. So I wanted to make the point, okay, here is example one. Okay, I literally look up to Selena Gomez. Because my pillow is there, and she's up there. Hello there, she's up there. And Robbie Williams, because he's actually from around here. Example two. I only have one example. It's from Bursa, which is quite close. And I know I say that I'm from Cheshire, which I am, but we're like on the border between Staffordshire and Cheshire. So it's like, yeah. Anyway, those are my two idols. So I don't really have much more to say on the topic, if I'm honest. Okay, so I thought I'd do a sort of like unpopular opinion today. Um, so my unpopular opinion, I watched um, The Hunger Games the other day and it sort of spurred me on in this sort of like rant sort of thing. So, um, so basically I hate female protagonists, just generally. Because they're always just like, I'm so right about everything. And they never are. It's like, okay, we get it. Maybe we should have like a female protagonist who's like really insecure and doesn't do anything right and like dies halfway through the film. You yeah. know? It's the sort of protagonist I, I would relate to. Honestly. Yeah. So that's my unpopular opinion. That's my opinion on idols and my unpopular opinion on female protagonists and a bit of jazz hands. So I hope you enjoyed this Monday freak show. That's the word. Bye.